You know the old saying, the only thing constant in life is change. Well, change has changed. What makes that possible? What makes it possible for us to actually be able to do that? To adapt continually? Well, I'll tell you one thing that helps. Having a plastic brain. If we can do things that will increase our brain's neuroplasticity, then we can adapt. He did a fantastic job of engaging the audience, uh, bringing them along, and really having them examine themselves. What's the response if you hear a song and you love it? Oh no. Remember the whoop whoop that was, that was optional? How do we adapt in exponential times? How do we adapt living in a VUCA world? A lot of it really depends on the kind of person that you are. It was an incredible seminar. We've learned a lot. He's a very good teacher, and I salute him for the information he passed to us. He's rebel talent. He breaks rules. I want you to be yourself. Never forget who you are. Never forget where you came from. Our organizations are all going through a lot of change at this point in time. And uh, as a change agent, he brought us some uh, I think, great uh, ideas. We have got to learn to make something into nothing. We all know people, don't we, who take nothing and make it into something. The best part is we walked out of the room with some tools that we could use to help us with change management in the future. What happens in transitions is we open the door, we step in, and every one of us for some period of time is stuck, is paralyzed, is not able to move. We can't go forward and we can't go back because back is no longer there. So the message was on point, enthusiastic, interactive. He did it with enthusiasm, he did it with passion. He was very entertaining, very animated. Fabulous presentation around change and what we can do to empower ourselves. The good news about resilience is resilience can be learned. Whatever place you are on the spectrum, you can become more resilient. Mark was right at the top of his game and right at the top of the keynotes for the event. He had a great sense of humor and really connected with the audience. If you get to work with Mark, you're really lucky.